Hello and welcome to KSG India's State Series. In this video, we'll discuss about Kerala. Introduction Kerala, the land of Kera coconut tree. Kerala is also known as God's own country. Capital Tiruvananthapuram or Trivandrum is the state capital of Kerala. It is built on seven hills. It is a coastal state. Kerala borders the state of Tamil Nadu on the south and east, Karnataka on the north and Puducherry northwest. Arabian coastline is on the west. Coastal plain situated at the foot of the hills runs along the coast varies in the width from 35 to 120 kilometers. The alluvial low land is interspread with a chain of lakes and lagoons connected with each other by canals. The streams of Kerala empty themselves into these lagoons. High temperature throughout the year coupled with heavy rainfall during the summer months and high humidity. Thunder showers in the afternoon are common and beneficial for plantation crop. Kari soil track is found around Alipe below the sea level. Rice is cultivated after raising buns around the fields. Most of the hydropower generating plants in South Kerala districts, Iduki and Sabrigiri, which account 68% of the total installed capacity. Talking about the towns or cities. Kohikor is an important timber trading center. Alipay is the biggest weaving and exporting center of coir. Aluva, located on R. Perrier, is a large scale manufacturing center. Trichur district is famous for diamond cutting and polishing industry. Perambara, the rubber tires are manufactured. Talking about the population, very dense in coastal alluvial lowland. And high population is because of the fertile coastal soil, plenty of water availability, and low death rate. Talking about the geographical features of Kerala, the physical division, the mountain ranges from Nilgiri, Annamalai and Kadima. Moving on to the climate, the winter, the state experiences an equatorial tropical climate. The eastern highlands, including the mountain regions, predominantly have cool climate, which is very refreshing. On the other hand, the coastal plains of the western lowlands generally remain hot and humid for most part of the year. The chilly climate concludes by the middle of the February. The temperature in the highlands often falls below 10 degrees Celsius during the season, while other parts of the state maintain higher temperature during winters. Kerala receives very low rainfall during winters. Summer, even during the peak of summer, the temperature doesn't soar over 40 degrees Celsius, unlike the other states. The average rainfall in this season is 2250 to 2500 millimeters. The monsoon. Northeast monsoon starts in October and continues till November. Southwest monsoon arrives in June, is called the Edavapathi as it comes on Edavam month of Malayalam calendar. Topography of Kerala. The topography consists of a hot and wet coastal plain gradually rising in elevation to the high hills and mountains of the western ghats, backwaters and rivers. The backwaters are a peculiar feature of the state. Canals link the lakes and backwaters to facilitate an uninterrupted inland water navigation system from Tiruvananthapuram to Vadakara, a distance of 450 kilometers. The Vembanar Lake, stretching from Alapuza to Kochi, is the biggest water body in the state and is over 200 square kilometers in area. Kuttanar in Alapuza district alone has more than 20% of India's total length of waterways. There are 44 rivers of which 41 originate from Western Ghats and flow west into the Arabian Sea. The important rivers from north to south are Walapatnam River, Chaliar, Kadalundis Buza, Bharatha Puza, Chalakudi River, Perrier, Pamba, Achan Koel, and Kallariar, the Vembanar Lake, a designated wet land under the Ramsar Convention, bordering the districts of Alapuza, Kotiam, and Ernakulam. Rivers draining into the Achan Koli, Manimala, Minachi, Muvatapuza, Pamba, and Perrier. It surrounds the islands of Pathira Manal, Perubalam, Pallipuram. Asthamudi Lake. It is a palm shaped lake with a unique wetland ecosystem and a Ramsar site. The eight arms or channels of the Astha Mudi Lake, Sastham Kota Lake, 
It is the largest freshwater lake of Kerala and a Ramsar site. It is the major drinking water source for about 7 lakh people in Kolam city and 7 adjacent panchayats. It is called the Queen of Lakes and is flanked by magnificent hills on three sides. Lakes of Kerala Sashtam Kota Lake, Vembanad Lake, Lakes of Alapuza, Pukod Lake, Ashtamudi Lake, Punnamada Lake, Akulam Lake, Mananchira, Viranpuza, Velyani Lake, Paravur Kail. Waterfall Mulamkuzi, Atulkal, Chiapra, Tusharagiri, and Kesari. Islands Valya Paramba, Kawaii, Dharamadam Island, Vaipin, Gundu Island, Wellington Island, Azuman Thuruthu Island, Pulinkunu Island, and Munro Island. Mineral resources and availability in Kerala. Mineral region available iron ore, cozy code, Malapuram, bauxite, Suranad, Vadakumari, Chittawattam, Adichanakularam, Mangalapuram, Chilambil, Sasthavottam, Attivara, Silica sand, Alapuza, Magnesite, Palakkad district. Wildlife in Kerala. Agasthevanam Biological Park established in 1997. Agasthevanam Biological Park is a wildlife sanctuary in Kerala. The park is located near Tiruvananthapuram, Aralam Wildlife Sanctuary located in Kanur district, Begar Wildlife Sanctuary located in Vayanar district of Kerala, Chinnar Wildlife Sanctuary located in the rain shadow region in the eastern slope of Western Ghats, Aravikulam National Park located in Iduki district, also known as Rajamalai National Park. The sanctuary is famous for its biodiversity. Iduki Wildlife Sanctuary, the place is renowned for its rich and varied flora and fauna. Kadalundi Bird Sanctuary located in Mallapuram district. Kumarakom Bird Sanctuary, also called as Vembanad Bird Sanctuary. Nayar Wildlife Sanctuary, located in Tiruvananthapuram or Trivandrum, is the abode of thriving flora and fauna. Parambikulam Wildlife Sanctuary, located at Chittur in Palakkar district. Pichi Vazhani Wildlife Sanctuary, located in Trichur district. This wildlife reserve consists of Palapili and Neliampathi forest. Pepara Wildlife Sanctuary situated in Tiruvananthapuram, Trivandrum. It comprises the catchments of Pepara Dam, which has been constructed across Karamana River. Periyar Wildlife Sanctuary, situated in Thekkadi. Shenduruni Wildlife Sanctuary, located in Kolam district. The name derives from the Shenduruni tree, which grows in abundance here. Silent Valley National Park, located in Palakkad district of Kerala. The park is a part of the bigger Nilgiri Biosphere Reserve. Thattekad Bird Sanctuary, popularly known as the Salim Ali Bird Sanctuary, is situated at the foot of Western Ghats. The sanctuary expands over a staggering 25 kilometers on the north side of the Perrier River. Vyanad Wildlife Sanctuary, located in Vyanad district of Kerala, also known as Muthanga Wildlife Sanctuary, it is the second largest wildlife sanctuary in Kerala. Biosphere Reserve Nilgiri Biosphere Reserve The Nilgiri Biosphere Reserve was the first biosphere reserve in India established in the year 1986. It is located in the Western Ghats. The Nilgiri Biosphere Reserves fall under the biographic region of the Malabar Rainforest. Agastya Malai Biosphere Reserve The Agastya Malai Biosphere also holds some major wildlife sanctuaries, namely Shendoni Wildlife Sanctuary, Pepara Wildlife Sanctuary, Neyar Wildlife Sanctuary, and Kalakkad Mundathurai Tiger Reserve. It has been added by the UN's top cultural body UNESCO to its World Network of Biosphere Reserves in the year 2016. Economy Agriculture in the hills, rubber, tea, wattle, and coffee beside teak and rosewood. Both subsistence and plantation agriculture are practiced. Has three main rice cropping seasons. Coconut produces two-thirds of the total production in India, that is 56% from Kozikode. Black pepper, 95% of the country's production. Cardamom, 
Kerala's share in national production is 75% on upland, mainly from Iduki and Vyanar. D. From 760 MT to 1520 MT Iduki and Vyanar. Coffee. Kerala's share in the national production is 22%. Rubber. Kerala's share in the national production is 91.83% area of the country under rubber is Kotayam, Pathana Mitha, Ernakulam, Banana. Average crop duration 300 days, water requirement 3000 mm. Irrigation. Only 18% net sown area under irrigation. Rice is cultivated mainly on irrigated land. Kerala is food deficient. Dams. Banasura Sagar Dam, Parambikulam Dam, Malampuza Dam, Valyar Dam. Crop distribution. Coconut rubber, rice, UNESCO sites, Nilgiri, Agastya Malai, and Western Ghats. Let us get into the culture of Kerala. Language. Malayalam is the official language of Kerala. It belongs to the Dravidian family. P. Ezutachin is known as the father of the Malayalam language. Festivals. Onam. Onam falls during the Malayali month of Chingam and marks the homecoming of legendary King Mahabali. Carnival of Onam lasts for 10 days and brings out the best of Kerala culture and tradition. Trichur Puram by Yappar Jalotsavam Sabari Mala Thayyam Talking about the dances, Chavitunatkam is the stamping drama. Kathakali Kathakali is a blend of dance, music, acting and dramatized stories which are mostly adapted from the Indian epics. It is a stylist art form. The four aspects of Abhinaya, Angika, Aharya, Vachika, Satvika and the Nritta, Nritya and Natya aspects are combined perfectly. Kathakali is generally performed by male dancers. Kolkli, Kuthu, Kuttyatam, Mohiniyatam. Mohiniyatam literally interpreted as the dance of Mohini, the celestial enchantress of the Hindu mythology, is the classical solo dance form of Kerala. It is a sensual classical dance that involves graceful movements. Mohiniyatam is performed only by women. Thirvathir Kala Ottam Thulal, Chakyar Kothu, and Thayyam. Kalari Payatu. It is a martial art form widely practiced in Kerala. It is considered as the mother of all martial arts. Tribes. Hilpulya, Kadar, Kattu Nayakan, Koraga, Mudugar, Palian, Uladan. Irular. They inhabit the area of the Nilgiri Mountains. Recently, this community got the status of scheduled tribe. The community has traditionally hunter-gatherer. Cheraman Jumma Masjid The Cheraman Jumma Masjid is a popular mosque situated in Mithala village in Kodugalur of Kerala. The mosque is supposed to be built during 629 AD by Malik Ibn Dinar. IMP Institution Center for Development Studies, Thiruvananthapuram Center for Water Resources Development and Management, Kunamangalam, Koekod National Transportation Planning and Research Center, Thiruvananthapuram Rajiv Gandhi Center for Biotechnology, Thiruvananthapuram Bioinformatics Center, Thiruvananthapuram National Center for Earth Science Studies, Thiruvananthapuram Bharat Bhavan, Nalanda, Thiruvananthapuram Johar Lal Nehru Tropical Botanic Garden and Research Institute Tiruvananthapuram and Center for Heritage Studies Arnakulam Talking about the transport Inland Waterways National Waterway No. 3 The West Coast Canal or National Waterway No. 3 is a 168km stretch of this inland navigational route located in Kerala and runs from Kolam to Kotapuram There are 41 navigable rivers in Kerala Cochin port is the only major port in Kerala. Talking about the airports in Tiruvananthapuram, Kochi, world's first airport completely powered by solar energy. Some facts. Kanur, first zero landless district in the country. Mallapuram, first illiterate district in the country. Kotayam is also called as Akshara Nagri, which means the city of letters considering its contribution to print media and literature. Kotayam town is the first town in India to have achieved 100% literacy. The Western Ghats bordering the eastern boundaries of the state from an almost continuous mountain wall except near Pallakkad where there is a natural mountain pass known as Pallakkad Gap. Alapuza is also known as the Venice of the East. 
highest peak of Annamudi, situated in the Western Ghats region of Kerala. It is also the highest point of Western Ghats. The Sastha Makuta is a lake, the only major freshwater lake in the state is a Kolam district. The annual Nehru Trophy Boat Race takes place on the backwaters of Punnamada in Alapuza.